Make it stop that chicka chicka Big a mic bro hammer Bigger Mike the Bro Hammer, Bro Hammer TV, Bro Mobile Confessions, Episode One. See my screens falling from the sky. <laughs> anyway, so thought I'd make a quick video to introduce myself to those who may not know me or know my story. Uh, my name is Michael. I go by the bro hammer that's my bro name but anyway um i got into uh, training in fitness and nutrition back in 2011 well let me just rewind that all the way back okay first of all i was born fat basically you know um like we all are except i just kept it on as i got older and older i've always been a big boy um you know always like to eat love real food you know my grandmother would would cook pretty much every day um you know we, we spent a lot of time over there so she would you know hook us up with the food good good soul food you know fried steak dip the steak in some in some flour and fry it up so it'll be like a, a chicken fried sirloin basically i mean it was good but you know um i just picked up a lot of a lot of bad habits, generational habits that were passed down as far as eating and everything. You know, I didn't really know much about nutrition and exercise, but anyway, so um, my weight got way above about above 400 pounds. About in 2011 um, is when I reached my breaking point and um, I stepped on the scale, surprised it didn't break. It was 420 pounds. And uh, I just didn't realize that I let myself get that big, you know? I mean, my my stats, you know, I'm 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 six two, you no know, brown hair, one gigantic mother. Just playing, that's from Commando. But anyway, yeah. So you know, um, seriously, I was 420 pounds, and I just reached a breaking point. And I said, I got to do something about this. You know, I was 27, yeah, 27 years old, 26 years old. I had um, was in a relationship with uh, the woman that is now my wife. We had been engaged for about a year and a half at the time. So um, I was just ready to do something, man. I had to had to make a change. So I, I hooked up with a personal trainer and um, it's a little shaky here. Hooked up with a personal trainer. January 10th was my first day of training. I swear that first training session damn near killed me. Um, I just did, I had no idea how out of shape I was. You know, I, I just didn't know. So, um, you know, uh, I started with him, training with him three times a week, um, training on my own. Once a day, sometimes twice a day, I would even go out on my lunch breaks in a sauna suit uh, and run up and down a hill, you know, for my whole lunch break. And I would just eat at my desk. Speaking of the eating, that, that whole period that I was training with, uh, with this guy, with his personal trainer, he had me on a 1200 calorie diet. So you can imagine, um, if I stuck to my diet and uh, did did what I needed to do, I was in a, a major caloric deficit. So I dropped a lot of weight. I, I lost over about 150 pounds in eight months. Um, not very healthy, but it was extreme. I was in an extreme state and I needed to do something extreme to uh, to get my life back and, and change my life and, and be proactive instead of reactive. You know, I didn't want to wait until I, uh, you know, got older and my body started failing on me and you know I'm having to take diabetes medication and high blood pressure medication and you know I'm 40 years old having a heart attack I had to do something man so um, yeah and I just I just fell in love with training and weightlifting I've always been a big you know I've been a bodybuilding fan like uh, I love Arnold Schwarzenegger I love all his movies so I knew about bodybuilding and it was something that I um, always wanted to do I always wanted to get in shape I just didn't know how and I'm just very thankful that I found, you know, got in touch with somebody that, that could help me. And I was at a point to where I was determined and I was gonna follow it through. So that was one thing that I was always angry with myself about was that I never 
really followed anything through that I set out to do for myself. And when I did that, it was like a light switch went off. And I said, okay, whenever I set out to do something, I'm gonna follow it through all the way to the end. You know, I know it's gonna be days where it's gonna be hard and I'm gonna to wanna to give up or I may have, you know, failures or not really failures, but just bumps in the road and learning experiences here and there, but I just can't stop. So that, that did something to me that gave me a determination and a drive and it showed me that I could be great, basically. <clears throat> so um, a little bit after that, uh, I, I worked with that trainer for about nine months and um, the relationship just kind of, just kind of soured. Um, you know, I, 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 it, it came to a point that I was more dedicated or more committed than he was. And, you know, um, basically I would get up in the morning and I would be out, be ready to go out the door because I was going to train with him at 430 in the morning, you know, three times a week. And it would be a lot of times, some weeks he would cancel every single day at the last minute. It's four o'clock and I'm about to walk out of my door to drive, you know, 15 miles to go train. And he's canceled, so I had to, you know, had to end a relationship, unfortunately. But, um, but then I, I met I met another uh, another trainer, and actually, me and him are best, pretty good friends right now. I would say he's one of my best friends. He's another bro, Brometheus. Um, <laughs> so, you know, I, I started. Uh, he started training me, and uh, kind of int really introduced me into the world of bodybuilding and proper nutrition you know, how to eat to fuel your workouts and everything. So um, I definitely put back on some weight. Not all of it good, but you know, I did put on a lot of muscle, get stronger and everything. You know. Eventually, you know, me me and the Brometheus got so cool that uh, we just started, you know, training together. He was like, hey man, you know, you don't got to pay for it. Let's just work out together. We're cool, we friends. So, you know, we just work out together. Now, what is my channel about okay what is bro hammer tv it is everything that the bro hammer loves and that's gonna be food fun and travel no that's an inside joke it's gonna be uh you know bodybuilding nutrition um movie movie reviews you know uh reactions to current events like the nba finals I'm gonna talk about LeBron sexuals trying to uh, trying to put LeBron on a pedestal above Jordan. Um, I'm gonna get on all of that stuff. Uh, I'm gonna talk about music. Um, I'm a big Michael Jackson fan. I love Michael Jackson. Just why you wanna trip on me? So I'm definitely gonna drop a Michael Jackson video every now and then. Uh, but yeah, you know, I'm just gonna bring everybody into my world, kind of show you what I do day to day, and just have fun, just, you know, talk about what's on my mind or whatever. So, you know, go ahead and subscribe. I, I guarantee you're gonna enjoy it. Subscribe, make sure you hit the uh, the bell icon so you can get notifications on my newest videos. Um, I'm definitely gonna be dropping uh, several times a week. But, uh, but yeah, just come on into my world, Bro Hammer TV.